Sun salutation, the basic. With an inhale, take your hands up. You're going to breathe three times in this position. As you inhale, raise the rib cage, growing taller. Two breaths and three breaths. Diving forward into an easy variation of a forward bend. Again, nasal breathing. So as you inhale, count to three, and as you exhale, counting to three. So the knees are bent here to ease up the pressure on the hamstrings and make things simple. We're going to inhale, look forward, and flatten the lower back, supporting our hands very lightly on the shins and taking three breaths. Inhaling and exhaling, never holding your breath. Bending the knees, we're going to come back to a plank position, a straight position, or engaging the waist. Again, nasal breathing here. Slowly down, bending the knees. Knees will touch the ground. And with an inhale, we're going to scoop to upward facing dog, looking upward. The knees are on the ground and the hips are on the ground in this variation. So inhaling and exhaling is a three count. Exhaling now, folding to downward facing dog. Tucking your chin, pressing your arms straight, keeping the knees bent for safety. We'll move on later to a straight leg variation. Just keeping things very simple on your first sun salutation. We're still warming up. So drawing the breath in through the nose and exhaling through the nose. Stepping forward, gazing upward. Nasal breathing, supporting again on the shins. You can try to straighten your legs out a little bit more in this variation. Controlling your breathing, focusing on the breath. Exhaling into a simple forward bend. The knees are still slightly bent. Just controlling here for three breaths. Taking your time, never rushing. On an inhale, you're going to come all the way back up, interlacing the fingers again, reaching up as tall as you can, maintaining a lifted posture. Again, focusing. When you inhale, you're going to raise upward. When you exhale, you're going to release and maintain your pose. Second variation, intermediate variation sun citation. Inhale, taking the palms together. Again, maintaining this pose for three breaths. All of these poses are held for a three count, three breaths, and then exhale, folding forward into a little bit more complicated, deeper variation. So my legs are straight. Again, here we're inhaling, lengthening the spine. When I exhale, I'm folding a bit. Inhale, gazing forward. Eyes go upward a few feet off the mat. Breathing deeply here. Now my legs are contracted, my legs are locked, my lower back, I'm attempting to flatten out that lower back. And when my knees bend, I'm exhaling here already back to a plank position. Now I can lower myself down into a low plank variation, arms bending. So I'm controlling here and lowering down to a low plank position, I'll transition on an inhale breath to an upward facing dog position. Now my knees are off the floor. I'm putting the weight of my body on both my hands and my feet only. And exhaling back to downward facing dog. This time my legs are straightened out. Fingers are open wide. Nasal breathing only. Do not breathe through the mouth. Your attempt here is to straighten the back, straighten the legs, keeping activity in the arms, slow deep nasal breaths. We'll hold this posture for five breaths. Slow and deep. Bending your knees, let's hop halfway now to the front, feet together, eyes upward. So you want to try to maintain this pose, you want to contract those knees, keep your thighs solid as you breathe. Taking another inhale and then exhale, folding forward. It's okay to hold the back of the legs in this variation. Still trying to flatten the lower back, so eliminating the round in the back. And now on an inhale, 
we're going to raise all the way up to the top. Palms go together. Maintaining this pose again, three breaths. Each time you inhale, raise up just a little bit higher. And on the exhale, release your arms down and to the center. Advanced variation, sun citation. So we're going to inhale, same way. This time, the attempt is to draw the waist inward and raise upward on the inhale. So three breaths and then exhale, diving forward with a flat back. And now you can hold your wrist around the back of the ankles. The face goes into the shins. Breathing nasal breaths, no panic. So taking your time here, and after three breaths in this variation, we're going to go to a flat back variation. So we're going to inhale, look forward, gluing the palms on the ground, lifting the chin, tightening the knees, slow, deep breathing. So remember to start on an inhale and take that inhale all the way in, turning it around right away without pause. So there's no, no stopping the breath as we move along. Bending your knees, you can jump right back to a low plank position. Holding this position for three good breaths. Maintaining a lifted spine. Don't collapse in the belly. Don't collapse in the arms. And the inhale, look upward. Rolling your shoulders back. Fingers open wide. Locking your knees. Nasal breaths in this upward facing dog position. And now we'll turn it around to a downward facing dog position. You're going to tuck the chin into the chest, straighten your arms, flatten your lower back. And this time you want to put a little bit more weight into the heels. If your heels don't go back, it's okay. If they do go on the ground, you want to press a lot of weight on those heels, keeping the pressure in the back. Now bending the knees, jumping between the hands. Straightening your legs, look forward, tighten those knees. Nasal breathing. So maintaining the flat of the spine, 